living with an underdeveloped personality. In an All India radio interview broadcasted on November 12, 2014, a well-known actor had this question put. You are totally different on the sets from what you are in real life. How do you succeed in performing a role which is totally different from your actual personality? The actor replied, when we perform, we totally detach ourselves. We cast ourselves into the mold of the character we have to play. Our age is one of professionalism. And when an individual enters their chosen profession, they have to perform their role under some director. While doing so, they detach themselves from themselves for the time being and sometimes are obligated to do so on more than one occasion. But here is the problem. This state of affairs is not for life. A time comes when a person will have to retire from their profession and after retirement, they are faced with a new situation where in the pre-retirement period, they had assumed the role of a positive personality one after the other now, in the post-retirement period, they must return to being their own self, a self which may have remained in an underdeveloped state. Now, they have to live with a personality which has never been fully rounded and leaves much to be desired. The post-retirement period is one of the most precious of any person's life because that is the age of maturity. Yet, the difference between two successive periods of their life results in a feeling of desolation. In a pre-retirement period, perhaps the person was a super performer. Now, in the post-retirement period, they are reduced to being a non-performer, a non-entity. This explains why, in this phase of their lives, almost all the so-called successful individuals could live in despair and die in despair. What is the solution to this problem? Two options present. The first is to enter a profession that will last a lifetime and which the careerist can have job satisfaction. The second option is to start a new life immediately after retirement, a life of their own choosing. A person should then spend the time on study and healthy activities in the course of what they should do to try their utmost to realize their full potential.